Good morning, welcome back. Today is another edition of thrifting in my favorite thrift store, the Innova Fair Oaks Hospital Thrift Store in Fairfax, Virginia. One of my all time favorite spots. So twice a year, this thrift store will redo everything with fresh donations and they have invited me once again to come check out the full reset of the store for spring 2024. And so we get to come in and have first pick on all of the stuff, see what they've got in store, and I'm gonna share it with y'all today, so let's get into it. You have thrifted with me here before. You know this store is all nonprofit and largely volunteer run. Like amazing donations from the community for the community, and everything is beautifully merchandised and just fun to shop. Today I'm gonna to start in the housewares because it's right up front, and then I think I'll go into their luxury section because we've gotta see what they've got cooking in there. They also have an amazing accessory section, especially compared to a lot of other thrift stores. And of course, we'll look at all of the clothing. The fitting rooms are open today, so I'm hoping to jump in there and maybe try on some finds. All right, happy hunting. Where my horse girl's at. <laughs> Look at this beautiful mid-century barware set. I got one like this the last time I was here and what I'd like to do is bake a pie as a gift for somebody and then they can keep the pie plate and have the recipe. Like, how cute is that? Wow, loving this. Face. West Germany, $25. This is really cool to me. I like the colorway and it kind of matches my kitchen. I believe these are like bone dishes, but uh, I like to use this as like um, a ladle spoon or like to set your, you know, uh, cooking utensils on while you're cooking around the counter. I might get that. Whatever cult this is, I'll join. <laughs> wow, look at all this pottery. Holy cow. I don't know much about pottery, but I do know that $5 is a steal for something like that. And 13 for this platter. Wow. Let's check out the luxury item rack. Lots of St. John, but look at these funky Escada pieces. Someone who loves a funky t-shirt or a vintage t-shirt, this Escada novelty tee is everything. It's 55. And there's a sweater, too. Adorable. There's also a few really cute St. John classic knit sets. These are going for about 150 for two-piece sets in great condition. My pick for spring though is this St. John trench coat with these really beautiful hammered oversized buttons. Let's see, this one's tagged a size 12, it's 150, but that is like a forever closet piece, I think. Amazing. I'm a sucker for these classic coach pieces. It's so small and cute. Wow, this says Mary Frances. 
And there's several like really nice Kate Spade totes. I like this Marc Jacobs bag. Like that's just such a great colorway. They have some designer shoes as well. We've got Ferragamo. Some Christian Dior slingback heels. Tory Burch. And the Louboutins. Woo. Like I said, I think the accessory section makes this store particularly special because you don't always see a great accessory section in a thrift store and they merchandise it so beautifully. So I'm excited to dig in and see what they've got today. This brooch. <laughs> He's so cute. Always gotta check out the belts. Look at this. Oh my gosh. Z Studio leather. I really like the oversized buckle. Yeah, I love the kind of like Western hardware on some of these. Oh, and the chain belts. Those are really fun, especially for summer styling. The glamour, the drama, the sun hat. <laughs> Look at this scarf with all the little fruits on it. I like to tie mine like around, like I'll double it around and tie it so it's like a little bit thicker around the neck and then just a little simple bow or knot, right off to one side. That with a tank top in the summer, stylish. I definitely threw a couple of accessories into my cart that I'm very excited about. I'll of course share a full haul with you at the end. But right now I'm excited to dig into the clothing section. This tie-dye Levi's denim jacket for 20 bucks. Cute. This kind of tapestry style jacket, but super lightweight, the cute florals for spring. This ice blue color is actually a uh, trending color for spring that everyone has been buzzing about. So here's a little lightweight faux leather jacket, and that would be $12. This fun Anne Klein tropical print blazer. So cute, 15 bucks. This adorable rain slicker. Very classic and cute, $12. Okay, we saw the other trench coat in the luxury section, but they also have a small section here. And again, this is such a great spring staple. Find one that you love and it could live in your closet forever. Let's see what's cooking on the premium brands rack. This might not feel very spring to some of you guys, but this is so cute. This like kind of cropped uh, corset bralette top. 
from Windsor, still with the original tags for 43 bucks. They've got it for $10. Look at the sparkle. It would be really cute layered under something sheer. Look at these fun wide leg flowy pants. Oh, I'm a sucker for these in the spring and summer because they are so comfy. These feel like silk and they're Nini brand and they're $7. Gorgeous. So we have this, this is from Dress Barn, but look how beautiful and ethereal. And I love the handkerchief headline, the sheerness, the beaded details, the necklace. Wow, it's so pretty. Very like kind of like Y2K boho vibes. I feel like if you're into the fairy core aesthetic and stuff, you could definitely style this. $10. This is Kay Unger. How perfect for like a wedding guest. It's got beautiful details and such a fun color. Just cute and funky with fish all over it. And then I always love these dresses with the fully shirred bust because they fit perfectly every time. Oh, this feels like cotton too, which is so comfy. $11. This is an express dress. I love the uh, crisscross straps and they're like fully adjustable too. So that'd be a really cute one. Okay, this is a little more boho than I usually lean, but I really like the green. And it's tagged plus size, so I might try this on. The store is open for business and people are starting to shop. Okay, some of my finds in the skirts. Look at this beauty. Oh, walk around like a painting. I love the butterflies on this. I think that's so sweet. I could see it with a little cropped, like white baby tee with a lettuce hem, you know? Just really simple styling. And I always love a flowy skirt with a geometric print instead of being on the nose with the floral. This feels like something you could wear year round. I love a mini skirt this season, especially when you find these like flirty little floral ones in rayon. This is actually, I believe, a 90s Gap one. It's just such a vibe. And then you can't go wrong with denim. I really like this kind of like grungy wash too. It feels like it's a little bit more on trend with the current styles. Right now I'm super a sucker for like these short sleeve mock neck tops, especially for like the cooler spring days. You could wear this layered underneath some of your um, like summer maxi dresses and just add a little bit of something. Wait, I love this. This little cardigan. Oh, this is a Swedish brand I've found before and it, it tends to be, I think, on the pricier side when it's new, but this is uh, $8 here. I kinda wanna try that on, it's adorable. Ooh, maybe with the green dress, I don't know, I don't know. Some nice LL Bean cotton button-ups in these really cute pastel colors. It's great workwear pieces for sure that could transition to your weekends as well. Look at this little uh, vintage, probably 90s with the original tags on it. Sassafras. <laughs> That's really cute. I feel like that'd be a bit small on me, but oh, I love that as a top with, without anything under it, just as a sleeveless top or um, over a dress. I am loving blouses like this with the large ruffle neckline and that are like lightweight and sheer because I'll just throw these on with a nice pair of denim for like a date night or like daytime look that's a little bit dressed up but not too dressy and it's still really comfortable. This is silk. How fun is that? 
with like long white linen wide leg pants. Resort wear vibes. Here you go, here's the white linen pants. And these are new with Tags Talbots. They're 100% linen and they are size 14. Here's some plus size cotton shorts that look so comfy and loungy. Love those. And they're $7. Okay, let's get into the menswear section. This is one of my favorite vintage tags on t shirts Sergeant Leisure. <laughs> it's like militant comfort. <laughs> it's a little kawaii tea. Cute. Ooh, this is fun. Tommy Bahama. $9. Just such a cool pattern on that. Oh, <gasps> look at this one. Ooh. So loud. 100% cotton, territory ahead. 90s. Okay, there's more in that same vein of the funky print. Oh man, that's so fun. And this is fun. I actually have a shirt exactly like this um, from this, mine is from the 70s, I believe. Because I found it in a um, an old closet in a, my mom's house. <laughs> it's a little vintage San Diego tea. Probably early 90s, I guess. I like this Beatles tea, too. Really great Sgt. Pepper's print. And it's 10 bucks. Here's the shoe section. Listen, these... <laughs> caught my eye right away. These are Harley Davidson flame platform slides. Holy cow. This is like Y2K dream. They're not my size. They are 34 bucks. They look like they're brand new, never worn. Like there's not even a footmark or anything too. So 34 is a steal, I think. That's so fun. This style, the woven sandal is always so cute to me too. I kind of like how this got a tiny little heel on it. And here's some brand new never worn vans for 45 bucks. Okay, so very successful. Uh, I've got a little cart full. And I actually think I might have a couple of outfits that we can try on. So let's go in the fitting room. Okay, I'm in the fitting room. I know the lighting and the sound, you know, is a little echoey and a little weird, but I really wanted to try these pieces on for you because I ended up with, I think, like three or four outfits that we can try, so I think that would be really fun. So yeah, look at the bright, fun colors happening here. I've got some kind of like floral, fun, sweet outfits planned, and then here's my dad core section that we're gonna try. <laughs> Okay, so first I'm just trying on this top with my jeans that I was already wearing. Um, just to show you, these are, I think, sort of just a, a blouse that you can throw on that sort of like makes a fit. You know, I usually would wear it with like flared denim and then maybe a pair of heels or even sneakers depending on what I'm doing, but it feels a little bit dressy with this like sweet, uh, ruffly details, so it feels like kind of date night. I actually love it with my little velvet choker situation, too. It's giving a little coquette. We love it. Okay, next, another kind of like statement outfit making blouse. I found this, I think, 90s sheer bright artsy rose pattern. It looks cool, like it looks like flames and roses at the same time. I think I'm I think I'm gonna get this one. So I like how it fits too. Um, I threw it on over just a basic black tank top that I pulled from the rack for five bucks. Um, I have some things like that at home that I could layer it with. I think doing a pop of color underneath it would be fun. And then I probably would tuck it and then kind of blouse it out a little bit. This is tank top situation. Hang on, hang on. Okay, yeah, so I'd probably tuck it and then kind of blouse it out like this. Super easy, comfortable in the hot weather. Oh, let me try one thing. Yee, 
Okay, so I accessorized with that fruit scarf and those chunky turquoise earrings and I love this. I'm gonna get, I'm definitely gonna pick up all three of these pieces. Cute, I mean, that's a super fun spring and especially summer fit for I think about $15 for all three pieces. Okay, next we are trying that green rayon kenna boho dress. You can see it is missing the uh, lacing that would go here, so this would be a little bit corseted up. I think it fits a little bit too high, like my waist is too low for this one, so I probably could do with a bigger size, but it's, it's close enough. We can make it work, we can style it. I probably will throw on my boots and a sweater that we found. So this sweater, it's, it is a little bit too small for me, but also it's sitting a little bit too long for me. I like to have uh, my natural waistline, so I would just tuck it up and you can use like a belt to do that and keep it in place, of course. You can use a hair, a hair tie. So yeah, but I do like the combo, it's really cute. I love the detail in the skirt of this dress. It's so pretty and I think it's fun with my Doc Martin boots. Yeah, there you go. There's one look. I probably, again, could use a bigger size in this dress, so I'm thinking I'll probably leave these two items, but it does make a really cute outfit for someone. Okay, now we've gone full dad core in this comfy, casual fit with that vintage San Diego t-shirt and the vintage cotton loungy shorts. Okay, I these are obviously my shoes I wore today, my boots, but picture it with sneakers. Although there's something fun about the mismatched uh, look of the boots with this too. Uh, it's kind of fun, but I could maybe do, I would maybe do like high top Converse or something. I might snag these shorts just because I feel like I could style these in a lot of ways. And then I might leave the t-shirt just because I have a massive t-shirt collection, but it is really cute. All right, here's that button up. Okay, first of all, it's cotton. It's so comfy. I like how it's oversized. Um, and I like the idea with these shorts because they're also oversized. I like the idea of just only doing like a couple, one or two buttons on this and leaving it kind of open. You could do like a, a sports bra under this if you feel like you want a little more coverage type of thing. But um, showing a little bit of midriff and then just keeping it really like oversized, slouchy, undone. Again, maybe some sneakers with this look or sandals in this case for the summertime. Tie at the bottom. Ooh, let's try that. Okay, I, did, I tied it kind of sloppy, but you get the idea. Yeah, and then it gives, looks, gives me a little like snatched waist. <laughs> the other thing is, I think my husband could wear this button up and he likes these loud button ups like this, so maybe it's something we could share. I think I'm gonna have to get both of these pieces too. And that's a full outfit, again, for like under 15 bucks. All right, lastly, I just wanted to try one more uh, styling with this cardigan to see if I maybe still wanted it since I really like the shorts um, versus the dress. So I wanted to see if I would wear it sort of like this. And I, th I think I won't, because I think if it uh, didn't have all this gapping, maybe I would wear it as a top, but I think it's just a little bit too small for me or something, so. Okay, that's everything I had to try, so let me show you my haul. All right, I am gonna leave the San Diego t-shirt. I just I have so many t-shirts. I'm leaving the cardigan and the dress. They were not the right sizes. And then this, I already have a couple things like it, so I don't need this one. And then that was just the black tank top. I don't need that either. Okay, and then here's my haul. The sheer button-up. The funky menswear button-up. The comfy cotton shorts. This brand is called Alyssa Brook 2, by the way, and these are tagged a 3X. I'm getting this fruit scarf. This is an Echo scarf. It feels like it's silk, too. It feels very nice. So I'm getting these earrings. These two brooches. 
this one is a functional locket so I can put pictures in it. There's nothing in it right now. I was kind of hoping that there would be something left in there from the previous owner, but it'd be cute to put my dog's pictures in there because <laughs> I have two dogs, so maybe. I'm getting this chunky gold tone chain. It's got this oversized clasp, it's super cool. And it's kind of like a choker length, I think. I'm getting this dish. And like I said, I'll use it to like put my cooking utensils while I'm cooking something, put it by the stove. And I'm getting that, I believe it's a mid-century vase from West Germany. It's already behind the counter, so I'll put the, the um, image in here. And I'm getting this brand new, never used Bath & Body Works candle that is one of my favorite scents of theirs, Vanilla Patchouli. This one is brand new for seven bucks. And that's my haul. Thank you for thrifting with me. Thanks to my friends here at the Nova Fair Oaks Hospital Thrift Store in Fairfax for having me. Uh, I'm so excited about their spring reset. The store looks amazing. I feel very inspired for the upcoming season and I hope that you all are too. So I will see you next time with a new thrift video and y'all have a great day and happy spring.